welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys what I'm bringing with me makeup wise and like all my toiletries and how I'm packing them for my trip to Mexico. I'm only going to be taking a carry-on suitcase and one personal item for this trip just because I just feel like when I pack less, I worry less, you know what I mean? So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the makeup I'm bringing and also the toiletries. I do have it separated right now, so I have all my liquids in a separate bag just so when I go through security, I can easily pull that out and put it in its own tray you know so I don't have to like dig through and whatnot anyways let's go ahead and get started so this is my makeup bag this is the Louis Vuitton Truce toilet number 23 so it's the medium size and then I also have like I said my liquids bag and I actually have two liquid bags right here this one my husband's going to be carrying it has all of our like shampoo and conditioner and toothpaste and stuff like that so he'll be carrying this one but i thought it would be a good idea to show you guys what we always pack and then this right here is my liquids bag this is the one i'm going to be carrying through security and this has mostly like my makeup that are liquid and then this is the rest of my makeup i know there's a lot i really try to pack less this time but i just i just can't you know a girl's gotta have options right so yeah, I tried my best, you guys. And also, I don't have all my brushes packed right now. As you can see, they're all back there. They're still very dirty. I still have to wash them. But I will be putting them in this case, I think. Either this one or kind of like a little pencil case. I'm not sure yet. Um, but either way, this is... I use this all the time or like a pencil case looking thing. But if you're wondering what this is, it's a Huggies case. Like a Huggies wipes container. It's like plastic like this. And... I like using this because like all your brushes lay flat and I don't know, they don't like get squished or anything like that. So I don't know, I just always like to use this or like a pencil case like I said. So that's that. Anyways, I'll go ahead and show you the toiletry bags first. So this is what they look like. They're exactly the same size. So this one I actually purchased at Aeropostal years ago, like five years ago. So I've been traveling with this for forever and yeah it's just a good bag i don't think they sell it anymore because i got it as a gift a long time ago and this is something i bought recently on amazon for my husband because he always just used to put his stuff in like ziploc bags and i don't know this is just like so much better you know so yeah this is from amazon and it is tsa approved so yeah and they're like identical and i love it because you can really pack a lot in these so i'll go ahead and show you this first by the way, I believe this was around $12.99 on Amazon. So like I said, my husband is going to be carrying this one. And in here, I just have two conditioners, like hair conditioners. Um, I always pack conditioners. I don't usually pack shampoos just because hotels give you shampoos. And I don't care for shampoo. I just really have to have conditioner. And I have to have good conditioner and a lot of conditioner because I have a lot of hair. So I always pack two conditioners with me. I have here sunscreen because we will be obviously in Mexico and it'll be hot, I think. I don't know. So I'm just packing one sunscreen. I hope that's enough. Um, I have here my Murad hydrating toner. I like this one because you can just easily like spray it and then you just pat it down and you're good to go. So you don't need any like cotton balls or anything like that. Um, I have here my Murad Clarifying Cleanser, and I always have to have this with me. And the other cleanser that I have in here, I have put in a clear bottle, and this is actually the Polish Choice cleanser that I always, always use. So I have those two cleansers, and my husband uses that as well if he needs to. I have here a deodorant for myself. And also one for my husband. They're both like mini sizes. You can get them anywhere for like a dollar. I have here a Murad Acne Spot Fast Fix. And this is great when you have like random breakouts. My husband uses this all the time. And then I have here a brand new tube of toothpaste. And then I have this. This is the Bifacil. It's like an eye makeup remover from Lancome. It's just like a mini size of it. And lastly, we have here a Tide To Go. So that is everything that's in this bag. Not a whole lot, but you can definitely fit so much more if you need to. And then this is the one that I'm going to be carrying. Again, this bag is from Aeropostale. And in here I have 
some lashes. I just kept it in the box that it came with. Then I have my Pure Cosmetics Air Perfection CC Cushion Foundation. I'm bringing this with me because it has SPF 50 for daytime, so that's gonna be fantastic. I have here my eye cream from Lancome. This is amazing. It really just like gives my under eyes hydration and also like makes them um, not so puffy and just fills in all the wrinkles and I don't know, it's great, I love it. <laughs> and then I have here a, a Cosmetics CC cream or CC foundation and this is in the color tan so in case I get darker while I'm over there I have a dark foundation with me that's why I have that I have here my makeup forever mist and fix just setting spray I have a primer this is from Lancome it's the it's the La Base Pro Primer and this is great because it's oil free all right, I have here my concealer. It's the NARS Radiant Concealer. It's just like a mini size of it. And then I have another eye cream from Lancome. It's the same one. It's just like a mini sample size. I have my lash glue. I have a mini size of the Benefit Professional in case I need something a little bit more, I don't know, pore filling, I guess. <laughs> and then I have here the Lancome Visionaire. Um, it's like a moisturizer for nighttime so that's that i don't want to bring like my big tub of it because that's too heavy it's like glass so it's just too much so i'm bringing this mini size and then this is my foundation it's the hourglass vanish stick it's just perfect for traveling because it's so like tiny and like you can do your foundation super fast with it and then i have to have this one since i'm going somewhere warmer I get really oily on the T-zone, so this I know is going to mattify my face all day long. It's the Murad Oil Control Mattifier. It also has SPF, so it's great for daytime. And yeah, so I have that with me, and that's everything that's going to be in this liquid bag. And now on to my makeup bag, which is this guy, and it's, it's pretty full, but not like... I mean, I can put so much more if I need to. Um, so... I'm gonna try and show you. So that is what it looks like. As you can see, it is pretty full, but it's everything I need. <laughs> okay, so it's just like some of these items are super bulky and I wish to have like a different type of packaging on them, but what can you do? So I have here my eyelash curler. I am also bringing my Too Faced bronzer. I love this so much. I'm like obsessed, you guys. Love it. Okay, and then I have the Jouer Lip Cream in Terra. It's what I have on right now. So it's just kind of like floating around. Usually whatever is on my lips goes into my purse anyways. And then I have a palette. This is the Persona Identity palette. I love this. It has like all the colors that you need and it has a big mirror. So it's going to be great for traveling. It is what I have on my eyes right now as well. So yeah, this is just like a new favorite of mine. And then I have both of my hourglass um, palettes. This is the, just the powders, like that. And then this is the blush palette. It just has all my favorite blushes and stuff, so I love these. And then I have the Urban Decay Mattifying Powder, the D Slick. And this is just like translucent, so it's great for like setting your entire face and keeping it matte. And then this is the super bulky item that I have in here, which, ugh, I don't know why they did that, but it is really, really pretty. I love it. It's the Becca Soft Light Blurring Powder. I love this. I am, like, obsessed with this. It just makes everything look so good and, like, glowy and just, I love it. It's, like, a new favorite. So that's that. That's, like, the bulkiest thing that I have in here. If that wasn't so bulky, I would have so much more room in my makeup bag okay so that's everything that was like in the center part and now we're gonna go into this pocket right here so i have the laura geller gilded honey this is really really pretty it's like one of my favorite um highlighters it's just so tiny too so it's good for traveling um and then i have a tweezer this is from benefit it's a really nice like pointed tweezer and then it has this brush thing which is so cool Okay, I have my Neutrogena pencil liner thing. It's just brown. I have my brow stuff, goof proof, and precisely my brow. And also the Anastasia brow gel. It's a clear brow gel. 
I have my it Cosmetics Tight Line Mascara, um, the Leo Ye Brush Pen Eyeliner, and also a lip liner from NYX in the color Natural. And that's like my favorite one. I have the Lorac Concealer, and that's that. And then on this side, this is what it looks like. So I just have all these things here just standing up, and they're mostly lip products. Okay, so there I have my Benefit Roller Lash Mascara. It's like my favorite mascara ever. I have here the Wonder Brow in the color Brunette. Just because, you know, I'm going somewhere hot, I want my brows to stay put all day long, so gotta have this guy. And then I have my YSL like oil. I forgot what color this is in. Tint and oil, uh, it doesn't say. How come it doesn't say? It's weird. But it's like the pinky cherry one, I don't know. Okay, and then we have two more lip creams from Jouer. Um, one is in lychee and the other is in petal de rose. So they're just nudes. You guys know I love my nudes. And then I have the Jouer bronzer in the color sun tan. So I can like chisel, you know, do some contouring if I want to. And it just looks like this. I love these because they're so like nice and compact. And there's actually a lot of product in these little guys. So love that. And that is everything. That was in my makeup bag, you guys. Just like the rest of the things I showed you. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't think I packed a whole lot. It's definitely just things that I can do like a full face with and good to go. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave it as a comment down below. Don't forget to stay tuned for my full on pack with me video coming up in the next few days on Friday it should be up. And there I'll show you how I pack my entire carry-on suitcase and like all the outfits I'm bringing and stuff like that. So definitely stay tuned. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you guys soon in my next video. Mwah. Bye. When all of your flaws and all of my flaws are laid out one by one. A wonderful part of the mess that we made, we pick ourselves undone. All of your flaws and all of my flaws, they lie.